Guess who's having really bad anxiety today? It's your girl. <laughs> That's how you're gonna start it? That's how we're gonna start it. We gotta be real with the people. <laughs> There's no point in sugarcoating this. Hello! Fun fact, when I get really bad anxiety, it's hard for me to keep my eyes open. Like, I'm very sensitive Should to Should we use some sunglasses? <laughs> do I just wear sunglasses while I do this right now? <laughs> welcome to today's Trader Joe's haul. <laughs> we're just gonna barrel roll through this one. Hello guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we have another Trader Joe's haul, which is great, because I'm having a rough Monday, and you know what makes me really happy? Going to Trader Joe's. It's been the highlight of my Monday thus far. Went to Trader Joe's this morning with Ashley, my very good friend slash assistant slash photographer, and rode the little train on down to Trader Joe's, got on the wrong train heading back from Trader Joe's. It's been an adventure. And not everything fit in the wheelie cart, so I had to use Ashley's Ikea bag. I didn't go in there with any sort of plan today, and so I ended up just getting probably a lot more stuff than I actually needed, but hey, we're here for it. We love a big Trader Joe's haul. That being said, go ahead and get started. Okay, first, we got some fruit. I have been like super loving fruit right now. I love, what are they called? Stone fruits? So like peaches, nectarines. Nectarines are my favorite. So right off the bat, got another container of the nectarines. I got these last week and they're so good and I just left them in a bowl on the counter and I ate like three nectarines a day, but they're delicious and I absolutely love them. So very glad to have another container of nectarines back. I also got a thing of bananas. I don't always buy bananas, but I felt like Alex would want bananas this week. Don't know, just have this inclination. So I got some bananas. Also, I'm excited about this. I've heard mixed reviews. However, I have loved every single thing that they've come out with that's pickle flavored, except for the hummus, purely because it's more watery than I think it should be. But I got the pickle popcorn. Actually, it's called popcorn in a pickle. I'm hoping this is like a salt and vinegary popcorn. I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. I just brushed my teeth, so I'm not gonna try it right now, but I will pop up on the screen if it's Kai approved or not. I'll try it later. But I'm excited. We love popcorn. I also realized Trader Joe's now has like six different green bags of popcorn. Our friend desk lady asked us to bring her back the green bag of popcorn and we were like, oh no. <laughs> All right, this is an item. They've had it for a while. I've never gotten it. I feel like my mom's gonna be really proud of me for getting this, but I got hemp seeds. Hemp seeds are a great addition to smoothies, smoothie bowls, salads. This is just the hemp hearts, 2.5 omega-3s and 8.5 grams of omega-6 fatty acids per serving. I know these are supposed to be really healthy. I think you just get a lot of your omega and fiber? Maybe not fiber. I don't even know. My mom's gonna be proud of me for this. That's all I can tell you. All right, into the wheelie cart. First up, we got some more snacks. We got the spicy mochi nuggets again. So good, so spicy. I like spicy food quite a lot. These are hot, but I love them. They're very good, but they're very spicy. I also got another bag of these freeze-dried blueberries. This is my current obsession. I absolutely love these. They're like delicious little round candies and I love them so much and they're literally just blueberries so I don't feel bad when I eat an entire bag in one sitting. I also got some baby spinach. Summertime, I just love doing big salads, especially like with the nectarines and stuff and just adding a ton of stuff to it. So I got a big bag of spinach. I also add spinach to my smoothies. So we always have fresh spinach on hand. Got a bag of the spring salad mix. I think tomorrow on Cooking with Kai, which is actually going to be going up the same day that this video posts. So if you like cooking, I will be cooking tonight, as in Tuesday, live at 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. I think I'm gonna do like, people call them different things, like goddess bowls, Buddha bowls, nourish bowls, whatever you wanna call it. But I'm gonna do essentially like a big party salad. I'm gonna do the spring mix. I'm gonna do some nectarines, some other fun ingredients I'll show. I might put the hemp hearts in there. I have some avocados, I don't know. Also got some eggs. We always have eggs and we were out. And so I knew it was time for me to go to the store when we're out of eggs. Also got Alex the spicy porkless pork rinds. These are another one of my favorites this summer. This is such a yummy snack. I love these. So I hope they stick around long term because I really, really like them. And then this, I know they've had them for a while, but I've never gotten them. So these are the plantain crisps. They're plantain slices. I remember Trader Joe's had something like this a while ago, but they were sweet. And I did not want sweet ones. I wanted savory ones. They have like the plantain chips where it's little like round circles. I want to say these are new. I don't know. Someone tell me. I will try these right now because this sounds less intense than pickle popcorn this morning. Okay, looks like that. I didn't think that's how these would be cut, but here we are. Ooh, these are really good. Dang, these are dangerous. I really, really, really like these. Mm -hmm. These are Kai approved for sure. Those are super good. I like those a lot. Product of Ecuador. All right, this is new. I know I for sure have not seen this one before. This is the Azatar Tango Salad Kit. Some say it takes two to tango. We say it takes tango to sal- We say it takes tango to make salad for two. Okay, anyways. A blend of lettuces, sweetened diced dates, toasted sesame, salted pistachio pieces, and seasoned flatbread strips with a cucumber yogurt dressing. 
I think this sounds delicious. I think we're gonna have this for lunch today with salmon, and then I'll put the Zatar seasoning over the salmon before I throw it in the air fryer. I'm super excited to try this. It sounds really, really yummy. I love their salad kits. I think they're just so fun. So that one, I cannot wait to try. I got some more romaine hearts. These I'll use for salads this week as well. I'll probably put it in my bowls tomorrow too. And I'm excited for this. I got some part skim ricotta. So I wanna put this in the salads tomorrow as well. Last week we did the burrata. So good, so delicious with the nectarines, but I wanted to do ricotta this week. So it's gonna be a ricotta, nectarine, big ol' salady goodness. I got Alex some more of the rolled corn tortilla chips with the chili and lime. These are super tasty. They're like a knockoff chalky, but also really, really good. And I got another container of coffee. I mix it up every week, but this is a good go-to. Very easy staple. I got another cucumber. More so than putting cucumbers in my salads, I really, really love them for snacking and putting with hummus. So that has been a good one. As well as the black forest ham. These we use for Alex's breakfast sandwiches, and we were running a little bit low. And I'll sometimes steal pieces of ham to throw into like an omelet, or if I'm making a quick sandwich or something. There is a lot of honking going on outside. If you can hear it, I apologize, but someone is angry. I got some more quinoa. Quinoa is one of my favorite things to put in salads. I overcook my quinoa like crazy. I make it so it's like basically a mush and I put it with chicken broth or some sort of broth instead of just cooking it in water. And I think it's so much tastier that way. I hate undercooked quinoa. I think it tastes like bird food. So I'm quite particular. I also got another container of the jalapeno chicken sausages. These are super good. I love these and they're super easy to like cut up, add into a salad, add into a pasta. I feel like these are super versatile. So I love keeping one of these on hand just for like a last minute meal. All right, two toiletry items. I feel like I haven't had to buy toiletry items in a really long time, but it was finally time. I needed more of the all-in-one cleanser. This is my go-to cleanser. I love using this to take my makeup off. I can put it right on my eyelashes and it does not burn my eyes. So I love, love, love having this. My biggest gripe with it is that if you ever try and like transport this bottle of cleanser or pack it for some reason it spills out of the top every single time and it's a pain but if you're just like leaving in your shower or in your bathroom or something i love this cleanser i also have no makeup on today because of anxiety next this is the all-in-one shampoo conditioner body wash we love this stuff we don't use it for shampoo and conditioner but we do use it for body wash and i swear there is not a body wash on this planet that leaves my skin like softer than this. I am obsessed with this. And it's a good price for like being how big of the container it is and I love the pump on it as well. As always, we got a ton of cliff bars for Alex. This is no surprise, every single week we get cliff bars. And I got a big old head of garlic. I didn't have garlic and I feel like garlic is just like a staple that I need to keep around. So got another thing of garlic. I also grabbed another bag of the mini chicken cilantro wontons. I got these last week and we just left them in the freezer. And one day there was a day where like we were slammed with work and we hadn't had lunch yet. And I just threw these into a pan. So delicious, so easy. It made for the quickest, easiest lunch. And I really, really love these little wontons. Also got Alex another bag of the sunflower seeds. These I just grab every single time to eat them. I'm really starting to hate watching his sunflower seed habit though. It's starting to gross me out, but I'm still a supportive girlfriend and buy him the snack he wants. A couple more items for Alex. First, I got him some more of this gum. He really likes this. I also got him some more burritos. We got the chicken burritos and the chicken chili verde burritos. They did not have the steak burritos this week, so we got him two packs of chicken. And then I have not gotten this before, but I'm excited. I got a packet of the Branzino. I've been liking getting these like bags of frozen fish from Trader Joe's. It's just easy to like thaw out like one or two for us when we're eating something. But I haven't tried the Branzino yet. And I like Branzino. I have had Branzino like the fish before. I feel like it tastes really buttery. So I'm excited to try this one. Also got a bag of more of the frozen chicken breasts. These are easy because they're frozen individually. And so I can just pull out a couple of them when I need them to cook. These are super easy to leave in the freezer until you're ready to use them. I got some more frozen berries. I got frozen raspberries and frozen strawberries. I still have a bunch of frozen mango and frozen pineapple and bananas. So I got these for my smoothies. I think I'm gonna make a smoothie as soon as this is done. I also got a giant container of green juice. I was not feeling like my healthiest self when I woke up this morning and I said, I'm gonna wash away all of the bad feelings in my body with a giant green juice. I'm really picky about green juice. I feel like a lot of times there's like some celery and it's mostly apple juice, which is just like sugar anyways. I mean, there's benefits to apples, but I want something that is going to like clear me out and like make me a healthy person from the inside out and this one the ingredients are actually really good oh the only fruit in this at all except for lemon is grapefruit juice so that's pretty good no apple love to hear it <laughs> health is wealth oh it doesn't taste great though it tastes like I'm drinking a salad you don't like it no I don't I feel good about drinking it but I don't like it I like it okay I'm gonna drink it I'll share it with you but yeah I like it okay good 
All right, this was also something I've never gotten before, but I'm very excited. If you didn't know, I'm British, and they had smoked herring. I feel like smoked herring is like a very, very British thing. It's like kippers, and you put it on toast for breakfast. I don't even have toast, but I really wanted to get smoked herring. So it's in oil, which is not my preferred way to have like canned fish, but I wanted it. And we're gonna try it. I'm gonna see how I like it. We'll smoke fish. All right. Last two items, these are gonna be no surprise. I got another thing of ground chicken. I love keeping ground chicken in the fridge because I never know what I'm gonna do with it, but it always turns out great. Some of my go-tos have been stir fries. I've been doing a ton of stir fries with ground chicken or like lettuce wraps. So delicious, one of my favorite things right now. I also have been doing pasta sauces. So I'll just mix ground chicken in there and do almost like a bolognese pasta sauce or meatballs. And meatballs are fun because I can go like the Italian route and do them in like a pasta or I can put them in with Asian seasonings or Greek seasonings and do some sort of meatball to go with like more of a diverse meal. I don't know. I've been loving, loving, loving having ground chicken and just using it for like such different random things. And then last but not least, of course, I got my oat milk. I was out of oat milk and this is my favorite to put into coffee. So got this again and I'm excited to have a coffee this afternoon if my anxiety simmers down. Woohoo! All right, that was my haul for today. I hope you liked it. I'm excited about some of my new items. I'm gonna drink this green juice and I'm gonna make a smoothie and then I'm gonna have lunch later and I'm so excited to eat all these things. Where is it? These plantain chips, they're gone. Here they are. Are so freaking tasty. I'm really excited about these. You guys should go try them. They're fun. You wanna try it? I like it. Yeah, they look good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or anything, feel free to comment down below. Go over to my Instagram, follow me over there. I post a bunch of content over there as well that I would love for you to follow along. And of course, hit that big red subscribe button. I post three videos a week and I'd love for you to join. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. I look like the three blind mice. I look like Ozzy Osbourne. <laughs> <laughs> that was a really bad snort too. Oh, you're gonna have a field day with this one. <laughs>